All right, good morning, everybody. We are at, let me start over again because I don't have any idea where I'm at. Herf, Herf, Hershen, Feger, I don't know. Good morning, everybody. It is a Friday morning at 7.50, and we are at Harnish Feger Park in Dodge County, Wisconsin. One of the Dodge County parks, obviously. That was dumb. But anyhow, yeah, we're going to have a nice little park here right on the Rock River. So we are going to do a little tour, a little walk around this morning, see what it, it looks like. All right, going to do this a little backwards, starting at the... What is actually the back of the park, but uh, this is my site, Site C. It is a uh, dry camping site, no water, electricity, or anything. So, got my little solar panel set out there. So, we're set up here for four nights, and then right over here, just to the east of me, is the Rock River and the canoe ramp. We'll go ahead and take a look at that while we're in this area, and then we'll walk back up front and start back as you can see they do have canoe rentals canoe and kayak rentals here and nice little quiet river it's uh flowing to the south which would be down this direction very slow flowing river I don't think it would be a terrible challenge to kayak or canoe by any means, but uh, yeah, nice little ramp here. So there is the canoe kayak ramp on the Brock River. All right, as I said, uh, I'm on a dry side, but there is a dump station here. You can catch on the way out. <coughs> And a big barn there. And uh, there is some history here. It's some, one of the highlights of the, or point of interest of the park is the old homestead. So I have not yet really read up on what the history is. But uh, Harness River Park Barn Preservation Project. So we'll check it out. Maybe include a little bit of that at some point here in the video. At least put something about it in the description. Yeah, so they've got a little miniature golf picnic pavilion, playground back there, a couple of pavilions, bathhouse. concession stand, which I'm sure, well, I'm not sure, but wouldn't be surprised if it is not open. Miniature golf rules. Mining Shovel Shelter. Huh. Little wooden model of a PH mine shovel. That is cool. And a little wooden model of a mined mine dump truck or whatever you call those things. Ore hauler? I don't know what you call them. It looks like he's used to be a water feature there, but
and back in there back through that opening in the trees see some little structures back in this area back here in the timber there is I think close to five miles of uh, trails about half of them are allow horses half don't I think there's three or four different loops used to be some sand volleyball courts here and the playground and like many county state city parks it uh, probably significantly underfunded these days and not as well maintained as they used to be but still a nice little park really super friendly camp post here and extremely quiet yeah, let's go see yeah the boardwalk heading back this way let's see what's back here the wetland and river access boardwalk Couple of ponds, those great blue heron out there in that pond. Or what's left of that pond. And another one on this side. Pretty little flowers here. Not sure what those are. back at the river here <laughs> An old boat there nothing like stating the obvious huh if you're up for it this is a loop trail wanders back through the timber there somewhere but uh, I think I'd want to have long pants on before I tried that because it's doesn't appear to be too well maintained Little orange flowers are all over the place Now going back into the campground area. Back here at the canoe kayaking area. Plenty of parking for those who come out to rent or bring their kayak. A large wetlands area all back in through there behind those trees. And right over here in front of us is the river.
Well, this is the information on Har Harnish Figure Park from their website. Uh, just for information, canoe kayaking is $20 a day. First come, first serve. Fall Fest, Saturday, September 25th. All right, so it's 132 acres near the town of Lebanon and about a mile west of the unincorporated community of Ashapin. There's a clubhouse, two open pavilions, uh, as I said, camping, nine sites total, and a group camping site. Uh, hiking, horseback riding, cross-country skiing trails, snowshoeing, sledding, fishing, mini golf course, a disc golf course, which I did not see, volleyball courts, which are not usable at the moment, horseshoe pits, a baseball field. So that's uh, the basics. Like I said, it's a very nice little park. So if you're out this way and want a place to get away and it is quiet, no traffic noise. It was uh, the way I came in about two miles back down country roads. So it's a little out of the way, but uh, that does mean it's not next to Route 67 and does make it a very quiet place. So. If you're in the neighborhood and looking for a place to stay for a few days just to get away from the hustle and bustle, this is certainly qualify for that. So, anyhow, that's it from I boy, I have more trouble getting this Hershenfeger Park, Dodge County, Wisconsin. Till the next time, stay safe and see you later.